everybody and I'm back today with Mix Daily Trading. What is up everybody? Hope you're having a fantastic day. And yeah, let's have fun and let's go. Hello Karma, what is up? Hey, what is... Okay, volume 70. Boom. What's up Karma? Already Thursday. Just tomorrow and then weekend. Looking good, looking good. Hi Twitch me creator, meme creator. What's up guys? How are you doing everybody? like a month ago already haven't I? or two weeks just like yesterday yeah weekend is coming what's up Poki? what's up everybody uh, three weeks ago yeah it feels like yesterday <laughs> yeah yeah I, I, yeah I almost had a heart attack from watching it uh, to be honest uh, it was it was fun the, the last game with Prague was 40 seconds late did you get banned for cheating but Prague got 40 seconds late, right? That was crazy. And he managed to win it, that was insane. Oh! Interesting. Interesting. Oh, by the way, nice top 15 bullet. What's up, Joseph? And his username, okay, okay. Oh, wait, why didn't I post that? I muted it, but I didn't post it. Yeah, did anyone else watch Prague? Uh, yeah, Prague Arjun, no, no. It's insane. Hello, Panda. Smurf in time. Ah, so he's a smurf, okay. I mean, maybe that's why he didn't get for cheating, but maybe for smurfing. You know, maybe that's why. Because if before it was saying ban for cheating, now it says for violating TOS of leeches. So he either maybe, maybe TOS, oh, yeah. smurfing is not in T, is violating TOS. I don't know. I didn't read TOS that much. And I read it, but I don't remember every single point. H3 doesn't work. It looks like a draw now. Feels like black messed up somewhere. Yeah, but Paragarchin was extremely, extremely, extremely crazy. I guess the best try is C2 t uh, takes this, this for black. Yeah, it's stream sniping. Because somebody already showed me a game in this Portuguese gambit. That's why I knew it. Yeah, ninety three, knight of one. I think the knight shouldn't get trapped. Yes, should be fine. It is still a complete draw, but it can be tricky for white a little bit at least. of two yeah I had a fun 94 I guess mm-hmm not sure I mean, of course, black is the one who's playing for win, but it's difficult, I think. The 94, 94.
And surprisingly, this guy who's playing with black, I'm doing great with Gucci. What about you? I want to say Gucci and Pigeon at the same time. I said uh, Pucci. <laughs> what's up, Gucci? Or did they say Pidgey? But yeah, what's up, Gucci? I don't know. Because you have an extra phone. <laughs> I don't know, I'm not serious, man. Especially these lines, which I don't see often. Surprisingly, the player with black is thinking because, like, when I played him, he, like, had. I don't know, he had seven, eight minutes. Eight, eight minutes while well, I had three at the end of the game, so it was funny. They should be draw. No, no, for about six minutes my challenge hasn't been accepted. Well, that is quite a lot. I pitch for a long time now. See, were you still playing Sonic this long time or something else? Yeah, that was insane, Gucci. Exactly. It was so nerve wracking just watching. Like I can't even imagine what players felt while playing. That was crazy. I even lost how you. If I wait say draw end game. Can you three? Can you four? It's a draw, I think. Yeah, I mean you at least can trade a pawn stop and then play like ninety four. It's even probably easier. Just F E and Oh wait, F E ninety three check. So it takes King E three, this, 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 King F two and then King G four, King G two, opposition draw. Lens for row 4, okay, never heard this game. Yeah, yeah, it's Jack one time, yeah. And good night, 7 loss. It's been 7 minutes and the challenge hasn't yet been accepted. Hello? Somebody? <laughs> ah, I mean, I, I think there are people who are 11, like 3000 or something. Or even say fast is like 28, 2900, but I think he's 9. Or ten, I don't remember, but yeah. So I'm not as small. Yeah, and this is a draw. Hello, somebody. Out of ninety-seven thousand players online and thirteen thousand players in queue, there is nobody who wants to play. Yay! Can Can have three and then can have two. Oh, this can have three makes sense. Simple draw as well. No, it's not black queen. No, no, no. I'm pretty sure unless I'm crazy. Ah, okay. Black plays a four. No, but now that's a draw. I'm pretty sure if white goes king of three and king of two, it's silly draw. And then king g4, king g2. And takes, 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 king h, or king f3 and draw. f4, draw, f4, this takes, draw. So he could have even done that, but in the game it was f4 and draw. But yeah, black miss, missed. They were winning, I think. Before rook trade, I thought cc would be strong. Hi, Scarelli, what's up? I think c3 should have just won on the spot. Mistaken. Because otherwise, after. Yeah, exactly. C3. Okay, C game over. Hi, Junji. Thank you. I never thought about this question. I don't care. I won't think because. I'm not going to TV in f near future. Yeah, Knight of 2, I thought so. Oh, I got an open line 992. I've played him. Oh, yeah, that was an insane game against him. Good luck, sir. Honestly, I don't know, I don't care.
Let's try Bishop C5. HF Master, what's up? Thank you so so much for the follow. Oh gosh, Peshka, she's the best. Is the best is back, I think. Oh no. Oh no. <laughs> That's trademark. That's trademark. Hey, that is trademark. <laughs> why why aren't you on the your old account huh? why did you create a new account Did it just get boring on your old account? What is going on with him? Uh, yeah, th this guy is weird, guys. Be careful, please. Uh, can I try this in Queen H4? Oh, got banned. Okay, surprising. Very surprising. A DS if EF Queen H four. I mean live us up. No. Sorry I'm not becoming friends with anyone at the moment. So at least just full. Yes, Queen H four. How about Johnny will have a semantical tournament September first? I don't need any more Chef Master, it's so good. <laughs> I'm fine. It will be Evans again with Johnny D. It's gonna be fun. Yeah, I think F6 is the move. I'm not really sure how we can evaluate the position. To F6. Six. I'm mean, gonna take the sac, accept the sacrifice that your way will lead to, but we'll see. Yeah, I thought rook f8, so then I get knight of five ideas. Mm, thank you so much for the follow, Jeff Morris, and just stay here and have fun. Oh, so that was Puff Morris, the one I played, and now it's Jeff Morris. Hi, how are you doing? So the Rook F8. Yes. Uh, 
Uh, tá fecinha, meu. Isso. Not to be determined to this how to be good in it. What's your ELO rating? Doing good for him, but watch yourself. What's your ELO rating, ja uh, Jeff? I mean, uh, quite, uh, quite a uh, tip is just play your best chess. Ah, uh, but yeah, about 1580. Just try to check tactics. So, and like, it will, it will be like open so you can play with some super strong guys, or is it like in groups? So, for example, like, you are in a group like 14 to 1600, how to play Chekhai first, or like, how is the uh, tournament just in general? Oh, Daily Puzzle Karma, don't forget. Doing great for him. What about yourself? How are you doing? I do, but I never play on it anymore because. Yeah, rook one. Think a nice move. I'm not playing there at all. I'm not playing there since like four years or something. It's a very bad side, at least, at least already for me. Like before, it was okay to play, but now. And I'm already grown from being a kid, so no need for me to play there. At least for me, so I don't play there at all. Didn't open it for like four years. Oh, Joseph, what happened? Mubot, doing Mubot. Let's go knight d4, knight f6, king h8, something. Hmm, I'm not sure. Mubot mean bu bu mean bubot. <laughs> mubot being mubot. That is true, karma, but I I think I grew from that side. Say you use the name. I'm not playing there. <laughs> you listening to me? Even or no? Here. It is your bishop. Before I get a fork. That is a yeah, nice idea, Vahayon. That is very true. That would be nice. Should maybe consider it.
crazy ambulance. I mean, it's like as crazy as in Germany, but still relatively loud. I mean, I guess Bishop E3. Yeah, Rook J was interesting, but then F4, and I wasn't sure. Uh, it felt like I should be good there somewhere. But like f4, rook g2, king h1, dc, bishop g5, my rook can be stuck, my knight, yeah, I was really considering it, but yeah, bishop e3 is on the board. You have lost, don't, don't, guys, chill with the moves, please, in the chat. Or it will be a timeout and then a ban, please. Chill out with the moves. Chill. Thank you for the follow and your stay here and have fun on the channel. Oh my goodness, it feels like I have so many things, yet so little time. It is the slight problem. Like so many calculation has to be done. There's so little time. I can't. I mean, later in the middle of a game. I'm playing. I don't have a second now. <laughs> playing a rapid game. I have like two minutes left, guys. After after the game. Does everyone suddenly need a second when we are near in time trouble? <laughs> we will have a second after the game. Oh, you mean a second, like a second for... as a coach? What? What do you mean by a second? <laughs> If as a coach, I do not. Yeah. No, I don't. I don't. Okay. Now I understand. Yeah, okay. No, I don't have a second. Sorry. I mean, this is the idea.
C3, C4, CD, oh goodness, uh huh. Okay, let's go D3. Because C4, he had CD, I think. And this thing, CBD, wasn't sure, wasn't clear. about the move he gets f4 the bishop f7 i think no he goes he doesn't go for it um back into play ah that's a bad move i just like literally pr provoked him to play b3 wait d2 ah but he gets rookie too yeah knight c4 wasn't best but okay <laughs> just do something in terms of well it doesn't have to be perfect just make a move don't waste time it's important before this winning the pawn yeah i'm calling for the chat thank you so so much for the follow and just stay here and have fun this rookie stream and yeah no other than blind nine and two crazy game this was i'm really not sure what was going on ah no need i don't need any any promotion I think maybe, yeah, I'm not sure, I probably missed a lot of things, but I like this B4 move, the breakthrough, yeah, G4 was a blunder, he was fine, but then this B4, and uh, yeah, I had B4 one move earlier, uh, uh, what else, he had rook H6, it was super tricky, it was like ridiculously tricky, made in 24, I'm not sure, probably move mode. No, but this B4 move was great. The idea is if he takes this, I promote, or CB this, this, knight B1, and then, and then, yeah, and then winning end game. I, yeah, I should have taken, I should have played knight D4. This is this knight D4 mistake, but then, yes, I got this mating ideas, because if he goes bishop before I get knight D2, I win the knight. If bishop is here, I was thinking, yeah, that was a nice idea, and then, like, knight F5, I thought, ah, knight G3, knight F3 makes sense. So, yeah, knight c5 here, I spend a lot of time trying to 24 smooth knight sack. Uh, where? Move 24, I mean, knight perpetual. And if this, if you mean this, he just takes, it doesn't work. So I've focused a lot of time, because 
Uh, this felt very nice. It felt like I win after rook g8, king h1. But then after knight of six, you get bishop of four. And after takes, I mean, yeah, sure, it's good, but yeah, I like the game more. Even though I lost the advantage. After that, I played very well. Then, yeah, I just got my rook, and then bam, b4, and then I managed to win. So, 3 1 1, 90 accuracy. I'm quite happy. GG, thank you. I had this puzzle. Some biker outside, which just <sighs> into the rain. Yeah, I'm really happy with how I played the end game. And the game was nice. Well, uh, I'm like 99% sure it is Queen C6. But as I was saying, it I. I mean, two maybe it's d5. Everyday practice, Joseph. I said d5. Queen c5 is interesting. EF queen d5, but I'm not sure if it works. Mm -hmm. d5 now, perhaps, but then e takes f. I'm not sure what this was. It can be even something like bishop b7 sack the queen. Uh, yes. Ah, queen c7, ef, d5. Karma is hungry. Get something to eat. <laughs> and queen c5, it is somehow. Let's go get something to eat, don't starve. Karma is eating. <laughs> Enjoy your meal, Karma. Have a nice meal. <laughs> I think it's Queen if I Bishop. Uh, is it queen? No, yeah, it's queen e5 and bishop b7. Okay. Yeah, I had to play queen e5 and bishop b7. Why not queen h4? Because then queen d6 and he protects, you know? That's the thing. So I switch up move order and then I'm good. Because otherwise he takes d6, he controls h2. Yeah, and bishop b7, rook h3. Yep. Yeah, good one. Yeah, also, good job. If, nice idea. Just a little bit from move order, but move order is a problem I struggle with a lot and still because like 
you have the right idea, but then you think like, oh, these two moves are identical, and then you try one and it's wrong, so yeah. I don't know, e6 feels tempting. Yep. Let me put the camera a little, little, not that much, but a little up, so if this, it's fine, if this, it's fine as well. Gosh, I hate these dogs which bark outside like crazy. Okay, queen e4, b5 takes queen, ah, help! Oh. Crazy dog. Okay, what now? Uh! Help. Okay, thank you, dog, for stopping barking. I mean, I'm not sure. I think Elo is a feeder rating, isn't it? And online rating, at least for me, it's online rating, huh? And I think it's just a dog which survives without quite little water in plus 35 degree uh, weather. True. That is true. No, I haven't. Why, hang on. I think it's more on Chesscom, right? Uh, but I don't play. I just play on Chesscom Komodo. And... And uh, tell Tuesday. No, I, I, I don't have anything against the dog. It's just like it, it felt like they just uh, put the dog there, and then they left somewhere, and then they, they just kept the dog barking like crazy. Plus, from a sound, it was like an enormous dog, and I think it's better for them to have the thing so they cannot bite anyone, etc. And at the same time, they can bark. Ah, uh, 96, king c7, I don't know. Maybe. Oh god, it's so hot. Uh, ah, my brain is melting slowly. Slowly, my brain is melting. We usually have like on Fridays or Saturday. F7 or C takes. F7 can be interesting, sure. CD90. No, but yeah, yeah. CD95, anything works. I think even Bishop D5 should work. And then over Knight G6 or something. Yep, why I do? I'm not sure. I, I wouldn't be surprised, Gucci. Uh, a CD, I'm concerned about Knight G2, to be honest. King D2, Queen D5, check, and like D91. Just not sure about the line there. No, but I, I, I play football, but not when it's 35 outside. Ugh. Ugh. What can even the move be? G6? Okay, g6 immediately. Nice. Yes, so this is queen e4. If b5, I take and then the knight and the bishop hangs. And king d8 just g6 and a knight f7, yeah. So thanks, uh, thanks, Evolve. Thank you for the good idea. Take care, Jeff. Uh, I have this, I have this puzzle. If I'm not mistaken, I rushed with queen d3, and I think it was wrong. I think you have to play h4 first. 
Was it Queen D3? It was, yeah, I hit this puzzle multiple times. Bye-bye. Wrong order, yeah, yeah, it's fine. Don't worry about the wrong order. It's nice that you have the correct idea. Ah, help, I'm melting. Yeah, because, like, orders, you, I think you may have difficulty with them. And we have 46 years, welcome, everybody. Let me hand it, so yeah, okay. Because, like, I also have some puzzles. I'm, like, sure that the right moves, I do them, I fail. Uh, yeah, I, I can take some. I can take some very stupid decisions now, because my brain is. Yeah, bishop six. Bishop c six feels winning. Yeah, exactly. Uh Queen of three. Queen of three. Bishop c six. Queen c six. B c. Rook d one. Bishop of four h eight. What's the point of queen of three? Eh, yeah, no, bishop, no, 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 Bishop b5, c, b, h8, b, b8, h8, no, 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 don't play bishop b5, I think. I mean, the very least after bishop b5, he has h8, rook d1. Uh, it, it has to be this, yes. Do I just play king c7? <laughs> I simply play king c7. That's the question. Just, just because like d1 uh, is healed, capture is check. Or, 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 or bf3, rook f3, queen h2, this, this, this. He win c2. Thank you so so much for the follow cac hd xd takes queen takes your queen takes rook takes queen. Yeah, no, no, yeah, sure, 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 sure. But yes, rook f3 after bishop h2. So I'm not sure if it works. I'm thinking bf3, rook f3, queen h2, uh, queen h2, d1. Here, queen e2, rook f2. Uh, rook f3. No, no, d1 is with check. D1 is with check. Uh, maybe bishop b5. I don't know. Looks ugly. Yeah, it's with check. Be careful. I mean, though, it can be bishop b5 for sure. I like king c7. Mm, bishop c queen h2 doesn't work, I think. Can C seven I cheat? Yeah, sure. Yeah, the bishop should be fine. Yeah, okay, nice one, Joseph. And I think somebody else said it. Fun time together. Ah, oh, no, fun time together said it earlier. Nice job, Joseph. Uh -huh. Yeah, I was looking for something forcing, but then we should be five just wins. Knight c3? Yeah, that was a while before, yeah. Yeah, yeah you, you said it before, bishop c6. Ugh. It's gonna be th this weather for an another week. 
just just 35 yay i'm so happy you, you don't see the excitement 93 rookie 8 hi wendy what's up how are you doing yeah i thought 93 winning a pawn i think in it but not sure if a pawn is enough 93 this <sighs> What is up, Wendy? I think it's fine. Oh, Joseph, I don't know how you have 2600 rated in puzzles. Okay, this puzzle was pending. Yeah, but you definitely find some crazy moves today. And solve puzzles which are extremely this bishop b5 move was nice i think you should be higher than 2500 uh, 2600 in puzzles queen g6 81 queen e6 queen b5 a6 <coughs> a nice one so i play queen g6 starting queen g2 and queen b1 if he tries to escape then queen here boom 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 mate if he goes d1 the same thing and queen g6 91 i get queen e6 this is a certain queen b5 a6 and he doesn't have any safe squares for his uh, queen, uh, uh, uh. In the five foot. Ah. Twenty two. Yes. So, how are you finding these best moves? You're so underrated in your puzzles. Like, with your understanding of position, you should be much more high rated than 2600 in puzzles. I'm so surprised that you're that little rated. Yeah, this is back ring something. Uh, this, 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 this. Simply takes e7. And then takes d Yeah, I think so. Takes and takes. And can h7 and takes. Ooh, let's go! It's 39, 33. Nice. Nice solving today. Two, one, a six correct, one failed. Very good. No, after 97 I take. Because otherwise, after 97, king h7, he gets knight b3 and c2 doesn't hang. Yeah, but did you get three similar types of... Did you already solve three same types of position? That is quite impressive. Uh, okay, guys, don't mind me talking strangely. I'm just wow, 56 viewers. Welcome, everybody. What is up? I'm just my brain is turning off from the weather. Nice one, you suppose. Aye, do you bubble London when it's not actually London? <laughs> I mean, excuse me, how dare you disrespect me like that? Playing rook b1 and move 5. Stockfish. Make me disappointed. Here. I'm 
mean, yeah, of course, guys, this is an ultimate disrespect from Stockfish. Playing Rook B1 that early on, it is absolutely ridiculous how disrespectful that is. I am very disrespectful. <laughs> no, okay. Uh, oh, he has a castle. I was sure he castled already. Okay, Queen E5. There's some weird smell outside. Something is burning. Uh, 9b6, 9c4 perhaps can be interesting. b5, b4. But b5 in advance can create a weakness. So maybe let's just play rook f8 for now. Seeing what he'll do. Yeah, rook f1. Maybe go back queen c4. Queen c4. I play in a book line, exactly, yeah. But it's so many games that it's tired of playing book already. Uh, b5. The idea was 94, but then pawn on b7 was hanging. Ah, yeah, we should be 5 interesting move. But if I simply go 94 still, take the take take queen c2. Take the take take queen c2. Yeah, I think it should be okay. No, but in my opinion, yeah, about disrespect, I was of course joking. In my opinion, in chess, there is literally like, how can there be disrespect when somebody wants to play something? I mean, I, I don't know. It's my personal opinion, but like, what do you mean by disrespecting, right? Like, he just wants to play the game like how he wants to. And then like, if he goes for something stupid in the opening, where you feel disrespected, for example, then just win the game. Just show him that, that like you can. But like when you say, "Oh, I feel so disrespected," and then you end up losing. Like I don't know. I don't, I don't know. Like why? I don't know. It's just me, of course. But I don't think there is a thing called disrespect. To be honest, in chess. Just like, okay, okay, okay. For example, promoting five queens instead of mating one, this can be some sort of a disrespect. Uh, but especially in the opening, playing the opening you like, I don't think that's a disrespect. Mm, you like and you want to play. Because promoting 25 queens and 39 bishops can be a little bit weird. Instead of just mating one move for 25,000 moves. Uh, but opening disrespect, I don't think that it is like that. Okay. Ah, uh, rookie two. I bought games if open and starts one before. Okay. All right, Logan. How are you doing? I just want to force a draw, but he wants to keep on playing. <laughs> How can I force a draw? Yeah, okay, that yes, but like in online chess, playing 1a6, I mean, I don't know, for example, I don't think that's such huge disrespect. But yeah, OTB it can be some things can be very disrespectful. That is for absolute sure. Yeah, yeah. But playing some funny, goofy little opening uh, in online chess, I don't think that's a way to get disrespected. Rook C3. Takes rook b3. Ah, oh, my pawn is on h7. 
Okay. Let's play h6 for now. Or h5. No, but h5 allows him g5, I think. Or it can at least allow it. Uh, I think let's play h6 for now. f4, then maybe h5 can be good. Rook a8. Okay, he trades like that. <laughs> okay, 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 okay. Oh, no, but like... Yeah, sure, sure. But then, if if you if you make it like that, yeah. But then, technically, if you phrase it like that, then technically, grinding out dead draw in endgames like Magnus does is also disrespectful, because we all know it's a dead draw. Then why why should we continue playing? Or no? It's like it's a, we we know that's a, uh, that's a table base. If it's a table base draw, we need to accept the draw because like otherwise it will be disrespectful that your opponent tries to win it. I mean, my reaction would be fine. I would actually be somewhat happy that my opponent played for something that I have extra tempo or something like that. You know. Because, like, instead of feeling disrespected, try to find a way how to exploit your opening, uh, open and having some fun. Yes, king on f1, right? Yes, g4. And draw. Yeah, nice. That was a good game. And I, okay, yeah. Stockfishes are stockfishes. Why am I mistaken, guys? Because technically, as we all know, that uh, for example, rook and rook, rook and rook, uh, rook and pawn versus rook, as we know, it's a dead draw. If somebody like even tries to play it for a win, it is disrespectful, right? And then you end up blundering, and then like that's all. I don't actually. If somebody played Bishop B two, then Bishop B three would be happy. <laughs> that he has to spend one more tempo getting Bishop B two, so again two free tempos is black. It is more than enough to equalize for sure. Yeah, Ruby one was a funny move. <laughs> the game was pretty drawish all the time. But I, of course, can be wrong. Yeah, I think it was a nice way to force a draw with this rook c2, rook c3. Because if, like, rook d3, sure. They would play, like, 1 nil nil pretty much. But I think I was slightly better here. Yeah, I had 0 0.8. 1-1, one, one, I should have taken. Oh, but that is weird. You have weak dark squares and then you keep them. A2 or H2? Sure, but that's somewhat mind games. Sure, it can be not the most fair, but if you want to win, sometimes people use anything. But uh, we were talking about online chess disrespect, I think. Yeah, I should have taken and played like queen c7, knight d7, I would have been fine. Because usually he wants a pawn on cc, but now it would be difficult. Yeah, that is true. This is his ef and draw. 2 1 nil for him, 1 2 nil for me. I should have taken and then take, and then for him, he should have a 92, and that's all. 
All right, nice. That was a good game, I think. I turned off blindfold off, haven't I? Yep, and Lich's TV is also off. Ugh, so hot. Hold on. Let me put the cam a little up. Did I put it up at all? No, what am I doing like this? Because if I said, yeah, that's good, I think. It was H2, Bishop H2. But like, wasn't that a blunder, Bishop H2? Wasn't this a blunder? Was it... Um, And you meant not miss, but mess with the opener. What? In the game is left open and line nine and two. Neil one three for him and three one one for me. Yeah, I shouldn't have taken. I shouldn't have played knight d four. This b five trade the bishop for the knight and then it would be equal. Here should have been king h eight and he had c three, making my knight go away. And then he has then he has I think knight d seven or something. Uh, no, actually just bishop c two, rook e two, rook d two, and yeah. I have bad minor pieces, and he has great minor pieces, and he's better. Let's see if I was a plan, he should have went bishop d2, and he still would have an exchange and advantage. This is his, and he was very equal. Uh, then rook f5 was a blunder, he had to go for b2. Yeah, I messed up. With this knight c4, I allowed b3, but it ended up being not a blunder. Yeah, but like. If he would be messing with the opponent, like, ugh. it's how you phrase it, because, yeah, and then it would be repetition. Here a nice break b4, and I would be winning, but I played rook d6, and he had to go for rook c5, preventing b4, and then I found this b4 break, then c3, and I have two strong passers, he had to sack rook, uh, and then he had, I had rook versus five points, but then more time, and I managed to get win position, he ran out of time. Can we rewind, uh, rewind what? The Fisher's game? I mean, it's famous, Bishop H2. I think it was something like that for Fisher. I think I somewhat remember the game, if I'm not mistaken. I think it was something like this, right? Maybe not exact position, but yeah, Bishop H2. Maybe a wrong pawn structure. After bishop takes knight. Uh, where exactly bishop takes knight? Knight takes bishop? Or bishop takes knight? Where knight? Bishop takes knight. Bishop d4? What? I don't know. Never was too interested in them. Never was too interested in them. Uh, yeah, how do I prevent B4? Ah, uh, BC? Okay, and then Rook C5. Okay. Before G3. Yeah, but what to rewind? What do you mean, what to rewind? Knight C5, I took the pawn. This I tried to make some attack, but it didn't work. He took two, this I got good pawns, and then it managed to. What, what, what exactly do you want to rewind? Uh, okay. Against this line, guys, I have good, pretty exciting games. This one was nice. The previous game against him was also very nice. That I played the opening, which I don't usually play. And then I got a nice, super nice attack, even though it was slow on time. I found out how to get it. Then g5, 97, rook h6, and then nice mate. 
Eh? Stop right there. Knight of three. No, it doesn't work. Knight of three doesn't work. I mean, Sokri says it works, but he gets king g2. Knight h2. Then bishop g5. This f4. I take and exchange this. Stockfish says, but even Stockfish doesn't understand. First it says I'm like almost winning, then it says it's fine. This, this, rook d1, bishop f6, this. Now he's better all of a sudden. So it's crazy. King g7, c4, rook h1, king f2 takes. It's more or less. No, but rook g doesn't work because this, this, and then he gets bishop f4. Sure, Stockfish says this, but he simplifies. Pretty simply after like rook d3 or something. Okay. So okay, I played this bishop c5 for the first time in my life. And d6, queen h5, I got scared, but then bishop f5 apparently was an inaccuracy. Uh, this queen h4, this f6, this was a mistake. I should have a knight d4. Uh, FG takes rook d1. Yeah, and then there was this crazy line from Stockfish. Uh, b5, b4 takes. Should be to this, 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 c5. Uh, bishop here, this I provoke g4. Uh, and then equal. Thank you so much for the follow. Enjoy stay here and have fun. Leeches.exe. Hope you'll have a nice day here on the channel. Bishop h6, rook f e8, knight d5, rook e5. This, this, that was another mistake. I should have went king h8. And then takes, takes this knight d4. Knight d7, rook h5, bishop d2. Uh, rook d8, this, this, and after knight d5 he would be better. He has two bishops, my knights are pretty bad. This, this, knight d7 was a mistake. Uh, he had to go for c3. And then after knight d5, go bishop c1. And then, yeah, my knights are really terribly placed. He gets king. He gets like g3, this, this. And he has a plus 3. He has much, much better pieces than mine. And he's about winning almost. Okay, knight d7, this. That was yet another mistake. You should have went bishop d2. And after b5, this rook d8, knight of 6, rook f5, knight d5, rook g8, this, this, he has bishop c3 as his threat, this bishop c3. Bishop c3, rook here, this, this, bishop e5, this, this. f5, g c would be slightly better. Crazy line. I don't know why you include f5 in that stuff. Okay, dc. Uh, okay, rook g8 was slight inaccuracy, stockfish. I mean, yeah, stockfish is goofing between like knight of c whether it's winning or not winning. But when it goes deeper, it says it's not winning. So this, okay, maybe more force in his knight hf3. Uh, takes this, this bishop g5, the only move. Mm, rook g8 f4. I was just somewhat, to be honest, too lazy to calculate this stuff. Rook, oops, rook h1. Bishop takes knight and check. What do you mean? King f2, this, this with equality. And okay, f6 would be just slightly better. No, but this is g3. I mean, check doesn't do anything, just goes king g2. He escapes. Uh, what do you mean? I played c5, I tried. I mean, my idea was to, of course, play b5, c4. So bishop b3 made lots of sense. This knight e5. My idea was if he does something like f4, which is a mistake, I get knight g4. And after bishop f7, I thought rook h2. This and I thought rook g7, but apparently it's not good. I should have taken this, this, and it would be better. Yeah, I took my knight while checking, I took. And then g3, c5. What do you mean? 
Ah, in check. Okay, I understood. Okay, gotcha, gotcha, gotcha. My bad, sorry. As well, sorry, sorry, sorry. I understood. Yeah, that, that was a must capture. Okay, 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 okay. Yeah, understood. Yeah, if not, if it wasn't, then Rook G8 was quite interesting, perhaps. But then I still think after G3 or King H1, it would have been okay. So yeah, F4 I thought was a mistake. He played C3, D3, uh, Bishop D5. Was a mistake. He should have played F4. And the idea is just after knight g4, he simply takes king g1 and he's slightly better. Uh, b5, this, rook d8, this, f5, bishop f3, this, all good. Okay, that was a slight, slight inaccuracy, stock says I should have taken. And then, I shouldn't, I should have taken. And then play f4, c4. He has weak pawns, I have two strong pawns. Rook e5, this, this. Rook h4 and I'm slightly better. b3, this. I don't know what my goal is. Just to leave a day forward and then see. Rook f5 is a blunder he has to he had to take. And then rook d5. I'm not looking to be a doctor. Uh, rook f5, okay, rook f5, rook e6. This, 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 and then pretty much just repetition and draw. Okay. Rook g6, yes, was a blunder. I had to go for b4, and then after this, this, I'm winning. And g4 was a blunder. He had to go for rook c5. He stops my uh, b4, rook e6, bc, bc. Uh, bishop g4, rook e7. Oh no. Rook b6, this, this h5 is equality and then i found this nice b4 then c3 he had to sack rook for two pawns and then yeah time was the problem i traded my knight for his bishop and then i won two pawns and then he pretty much just flagged but i was completely win with him line nine and two yeah that is true didn't like comparing too much Okay, delete this. It's three two three. All right, and now let's do a little bit of Evans. It's like thirty degrees here in the apartment and like thirty five outside. So I don't think I will be here for like too too long. Uh, so but yeah, let's start. Was it here? Mm -hmm. Okay, so last time we rewind, we checked this d5, and then where white gets a very comfortable position. Uh, now let's check third most popular move, bishop e7. Uh, fourth move, most popular move. Uh, bishop e7 was played 74 times, but, but it's not a bad move as d5. d5 gives white a pretty strong advantage. Uh, so the carcass God help me ah! It's a cleaning car but my ears Ugh. there is some cleaning car outside feels like a rocket ship uh, taking over though to be honest Oh, it fast, thank goodness. Alright, so bishop e7. Bishop e7. Uh, computer suggests a3. Uh, but two human moves are b5 and c3. Well, why I will consider all the possible moves? Because this, you can play that as... Uh, call the police now. Mm, but you can play that as black, it's not bad. So, for example, after c3... Uh, you play knight of six, d3, castles, this, d5, and I think you actually transpose into some Italian stuff, right? Magnus played it, but yeah, it looks like Italian. Yeah, bishop c4, bishop c5, this is this, b4, yeah, it does transform into some Italian uh, kind of stuff. And then, yeah, Magnus drew his hand, Saronian. But okay, pretty much bishop b3. You can simply take and then queen d3, queen c2 is a good move because other, you attack both the pawns, 
So queen c2 is a nice move, and simply takes, takes, a6, a4, bishop e6, uh, I don't know, knight f1, rook f d8, this, h6, king e2, b5, and you get a very, very fine position with black. Uh, white can go for d4, but then you simply take b5, knight a5, attacking the bishop, bishop d3, d5, the idea is to win the pawn, of course, he attacks the knight, we remove the knight from the uh, attack, c takes d5, and then let's just talk with sync for a little bit, uh, you're in pawn, not the us, if the us, if your card gets struck in the tree, the cops will come, it will come as well, okay. Why would they just come to an old guy that you can't even open the door? Ah, because your car is stuck? Interesting, okay. Unusual. Yeah, but you simply play c5, castles, castles, and then it is very equal. Uh, you get a fine position. So this gambit with d4 doesn't work. You simply play d5, you sacrifice the pawn back, and then you castle and you are fine. Uh, so d3. And pretty much a yeah, d3 castles, knight bd2 is somewhat forced. If he goes bishop b3, you do the same thing, d5. If he tries queen c2, you get a5, you get more space because you have two pawns on the fourth rank and he has just one. b5, knight a7, castle c6, this, this, knight e5, uh, rook d8, knight d2, queen c7 with equality and you are fine. But maybe somehow you can play a little bit more safe. Let's delete that. I think the better move is d takes e, and then a5, and then moving your knight to b8. Maybe not a5. I don't like allowing b5. Yeah, perhaps just bishop d6 first so the pawn doesn't hang. And then knight b8, uh, bishop e3, knight bd2, this, this, not bishop c5, but knight c5. Uh, are uh, you play knight c4, this you take, take, knight c5, and then you simply five as black, and that's good. Okay. So bishop b, yeah, so pretty much after c3, uh, that is not the move where how white really fights for the advantage, uh, because black simply simplifies after this. And then white doesn't get anything like it's good play, and they are fine. Uh, another move is a3, which Stockfish says. Okay, take your fun time together. Have a good evening or the rest of your day. b5 is another interesting move played by humans. Uh, the only move from black is knight a5. Then white goes bishop to d3. Uh, d6. Castles, c6, bc, bc, c3, this, this. Has this ever been played? I just want to check the book. Um, okay, knight a5. Okay, knight e5 has been played a lot, which is an inaccuracy, but bishop d3 was played, I think, as well. Um, no, bishop d3 was never played. Bishop e2 was played as well. All right, these are main moves. Okay, so is bishop d3, but it's counterintuitive to put the bishop uh, here in front of the uh, in front of the pawn. Bishop d3, this is this. Knight f6, uh, rook e1, castles, bishop here, rook e8, d4, bishop a6, and then black, white doesn't get any advantage, really. Knight here, rook a b8. And black, I think, should simplify quite easier, easily. Even though the knights and bishop is somewhat out of place, after this bishop c4, black can play even better, I think. Ah, rook e1, this, this, c5, c5 immediately. Bishop a6. Okay, maybe instead of rook a b8, now uh, let's computer think. Uh, okay, we play this, and after this we simply play g6 as black um, with equality. But the good square is there. 
and then g6 equality you restrict the knight jumps with the good pawn and it's more or less equal if you don't want g6 you can also probably bishop f8 is a little bit better uh, because g6 can create weaknesses like simplified equalized bishop e2 is a slight inaccuracy uh, because black gets d5 knight e5 d takes e the threat is bishop f6 and at the same time queen d4 d4, e takes d, queen d3, and the knight of 6 castles, castles, uh, a rook e1, queen d3, bishop d3, and as well, knight is out of, but black simply gets b a6, this, bishop a3, this, this, bishop a6, this, and takes, and then it says sim they simply fight, and that's fine. So after bishop e2, after b5, uh, after bishop e7, b5, knight a5, bishop e2, d5, takes, takes, the only move for white is d4, this, this, and then black simply trades everything away, and then it's draw. Instead of d4, there is also a move bishop b2, preventing all the black ideas, uh, but then black plays knight a4, castle, castle, d3, c6, they want to bring the knight back, this takes, Knight c3, queen d1, rook a d1, b4, knight b5, knight e4, and white is the one who actually should fight for a draw. Another move after b5, knight a5 uh, is knight to e5, but that's even a big inaccuracy because uh, black sucks a pawn, then d5, and then they have two bishops, and then they get the pawn back, and they have two bishops, as I repeat it again. I will repeat it as well. This, this knight of six, and then after d4, bishop d2, uh, castles, bishop d2, queen a6, queen of three, c, oops, c6, uh, black just simplified and they're slightly better. They can play something like bishop e6, b5, and they're not, not worse at all. So knight e5, black temporarily sacrifices a pawn, and then they simply get in back on the next move, and they get two bishop advantage, and they're doing good. I was book played. Knight c4 takes, yeah, but d5, black weren't struggling, where they take queen b5. Okay, but knight c3, it's good as well. So why are you spamming? Knight c3 is an option, but then black, black plays queen c6. Yo, Yosef! Yosef, time out! Mubot, 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 Mubot. All the phone, Yosef, sorry, but... Spamming ain't ain't good here. Bye bye. All right, Queen C six. It was fun, but don't flood the chat. Bishop B two. Uh, knight of six. Castles, castles, and then it's equality again. Uh, D four. Black simply plays Rook A. Rook E eight. And after d5, they go here, c6, and they are slightly even better. So black has no problems at all. The most practical move instead of b5 for black right here is a3. And then knight of 6, d3 is this transforming to Italian. Okay, just one game was played, but Stockfish suggests takes, takes, takes. Castle, castle, bishop b2. Knight b6, bishop b3. A5, you suck a pawn. That is, we are looking now at the best way for both sides because uh, because that is the best play to play after bishop e7. If somebody plays bishop e7, that's the best way to play a3. Then there is knight e5, there is knight d4, and there is a takes b4. Uh, if a takes b, that's, that's an inaccuracy. White simply takes, 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 takes. Oh, no, they take c6, they include that, they um, ruin black spawn structure, and then like knight d2 with knight d4 idea, and they are slightly better. If black plays knight to e5, then we as well simply take, takes, knight e5 is again an inaccuracy. Uh, this is, let's promote that. So knight e5 takes a6, uh, this takes, 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 we should be 4, we again get knight d2, even though the pawns aren't ruined, we still have the same idea and we are slightly better. And if it goes knight d4, the best move, then we take twice on f7, king f7. But where is our advantage? Mm. I 
it's possibly okay I, I will keep this line just in case this is this here king g8 rookie one knight f5 uh b5 it said b5 is good but okay we play this this bishop f8 uh, 94 and it's unclear it's more or less equal but white can have a dangerous attack black can most likely will defend well that happens if black uh, sacrifices the pawn e but that's the best move for black if black plays something like bishop d6 that's a mistake because we get c4 we c5 idea and then he's forced to go back take takes and we are a pawn and we are better so this is this is this this bishop b2 knight b6 bishop b3 a5 after a5 interesting idea for white can be knight bd2 it can be an interesting move hi chess x player what's up that we take take rook a1 this we completely lose the advantage i ah, know that's not worth it for white yes yeah, so i think we'll have to stick with that for both sides this 94 takes 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 Seems like this, rookie 1, queen d4, 94, and that's unclear. But I think that's it for the for today, guys. Hope it was fun. Let me quickly rewind that. So, uh, Evans Gambit, e4, e5, knight, 36, bishop c4. <laughs> Too smart, okay. Bishop c5, b4. Now, if he goes to bishop e7, third most popular move, we go a3. Uh, we check both move, uh, all moves. If c3, black simply plays knight f6 d3 castles 92 d5 uh they blow in the center they trade queens they simplify easily if bishop b3 that's the uh okay they can play queen c2 here uh but then we take bishop d6 protecting the e5 pawn protecting the pawn and uh and oh what no bishop d6 Protecting the protecting the pawn. Thank you so much for the follow. Enjoy stay and a fun Desmond Hume. Uh, yeah, so we protect the pawn. Castle c5, knight b8. We regroup our knight and black simply simplifies. Uh, so that's not a way to go. If I try some to spice things up with d4, b5, black simply goes knight a5. Bishop d3, d5, e5, knight d4, takes six. Black simplifies easily. Another try for white instead of uh, c3 is b5, but then black gets nice move knight a5. If, uh, if, 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 if white takes knight a5, we take knight c4 takes, takes d5, we sack the pawn for a move, but then we get queen b5 and 1200. Okay, nice. c4, queen a5, we sack the pawn, we get it back, we have two bishops advantage, we are slightly better in both the lines, so knight e5 doesn't work for black. No, you aren't, Joseph. Stop lying, please. I'll oh, just explain. He's in 1900. Joseph, Joseph, please stop. Um, yeah, so if 95 takes, 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 black simplified. Equalized. If bishop e2, then black plays d5 this. They have a set of queen d4 and bishop f6. If d4 takes, takes, and f6 simply trading the queens, trading everything, black simplified. With bishop b2 you get knight f6 castles so you again trade the queens it's equality and the best move for white is bishop d3 surprisingly uh even though they put the bishop it's going to be in, in front of the pawn uh but black still gets a nice position we get some sort of fry lopez y position something like that and that's equal uh and the best move after bishop e7 for white is a3. Black replies knight f6, d3 takes x6, mostly Italian stuff, knight b6, a5. If black plays bishop d6, that's a mistake, we get c4 with the idea of attacking d6 and b6. Bishop e7, we simply win a pawn. If, um, if a5, white can go knight bd2, this, bishop e5, this, this, but that's equality, black simplified and equalized. And if knight e5, okay. A, B is an inaccuracy because takes 6, 6, 92, and white gets 94, they're slightly better. 95 is the same idea, only the pawns are not doubled and white slightly better. If black goes 94, we sacrifice, we get two pieces for a pawn. This is this, and in position, is, I call it unclear. White gets an attack, black defends it, and that's fine. So everybody, I'm going to end the stream. Really hope you enjoyed it. It's very, very hot here. 
so yeah so yeah it was fun thanks a lot everybody for watching don't forget to join the discord to name some well stream and well stream don't forget thank you all for following uh bye Yo Yo joseph please please stop trolling everything and everybody just please stop Shimono, I'm melting right now. I am literally melting because it's so hot. Bye, Karma. Bye, Chess Explain. Bye, Joseph. Bye, Manu Spurs. Thanks to everybody for watching. Bye, to Bye, uh, Bye, Hayon. Bye, D4 Forever. Bye, Gucci. Bye, Baby Q. Bye, Fun Time Together. Bye, Windy. Bye, Thanks Evolve. Bye, Support Life Sensor Nate. Bye, Anurag. Bye. Uh, bye, 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 everybody who was here pretty much. It was a nice, great game and life open, very interesting. Then good fast, so in 39.30, rating already and great game blindfolded. So take care, everybody. Have a gracious day and I'll see you tomorrow. Take care, everybody, and bye-bye. Take care. Bye-bye. <laughs>